YouTube, hello, welcome to the stream. Gonna be a little bit of a shorter stream today because dad has an ear infection and it hurts a lot. But I'm still able to stream and I did want to check out Disney Illusion Island, which is a Metroidvania, apparently. So I want to play it for a little bit and give it an upload and hopefully you guys enjoy. I expect this to be two, maybe three hours. Um, so when inevitably, inevitably, I can't say that word, inevitably, that's as close as I'm going to get. Uh, when this VOD is 10 hours long and Tina's yelling at me, whoops, but I'll be fine. Hope you guys do enjoy. Check out the highlight of the week, which is Pokemon XD, Gale of Darkness. Maybe play that again in the future. Like, comment, subscribe on the VOD. Buy something from Framerate, Merch.com. YouTube, I love you. Hope you enjoy. See you in a second. All right, YouTube. Disney Illusion. Oh, my control is off. Disney Illusion Island. This is only on the Switch, I think. It's not a full price game. It's only uh only 40 bones, but hopefully it's kind of fun for at least a little bit. Speaking of Metroidvania, Metroidvania's decided to play more Blasphemous in a couple of days, chat. Disney Games. Ooh, Mickeyvania. That's funny. So I should make the title. Kingdom Hearts 4 leak. He raised the volume a bit. So this is local co-op with four people. I don't think it's online. Uh, settings. Yeah, dude. Screen shake. Turn that off. Timed element speed, huh? Hidden Mickey. Oh, there's hidden Mickeys in this game. Males rails? Dude, it's 2023. Where are the female rails? If you know what I'm saying. All right. Well, let's go. Oh, you know where we're going. C. All right. Well, C rhymes with three, so close enough. Wait, what do you mean? Just, yeah. The control I'm using. Uh, Mickey? Mini? Donald? Oh, we gotta be goofy. Absolutely. Oh, you have your accessib- I hit the wrong button. Whoops. You have, like, accessibility stuff. Low-risk experience, so you can't die. Balance challenge, more punishing. Um, I guess we'll go two for now. Gorsh! Oh, they're voice acted. So this is, like, the new art style they're doing for- I forgot what the- thing is they're making with this art style i'm not 100 percent sold on it but i also don't hate it also it really doesn't matter but <laughs> what happened cutscene here we are it's mickey mouse Oh, did hmm. I not turn subtitles on? Maybe I read this map wrong. Idiot. Hmm. 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 Huh. <laughs> hmm. Nope, this is it. Mickey! Minnie! <laughs> There's the old ball and chain. Fucking Donald Duck, dick hanging out, one of the strongest mages in exactly. fucking RPG history. <laughs> the gang's all here. I sure am glad there he is. This map, or I'd never found the place. It ain't on my GPS. Goofy positioning system. <laughs> Hang on. We all got maps to this island. So stupid. We didn't send them to each other. That's so strange. It sure is. <laughs> Why didn't we carpool? Gosh, we gotta get to the bottom of. <gasps> hmm? Am I imagining things, or does everyone else hear that noise? Sounds like mystical twinkling. That is not a usual island sound. Let's go check. Dude, it out. his pants are so high up. 
The twinkling sounds coming from that direction. You mean the same direction these signs with suspicious picnic images are pointing to? No. That's right. Does this mean we still get our picnic? Is this all for a picnic? Is that the story of the game? That's the best case scenario. What's the worst case? Follow me. Wait, what's the worst case? Oh, his, his walk cycle. <laughs> okay. Oh, let me quickly check the... Oh, maybe subtitles are just on, uh... In the, in, like, in-game. Okay. Because I don't think there's an option to turn them on in the cutscene. Yeah. All right, I guess you gotta fucking listen. All right. $40 game, by the way. A mailbox checkpoint. Mailbox to save progress and are where stamped players return. Like mushroom stamps? It's kind of messed up for a kid's game. I, I don't think there's actually combat in this game, too, by the way. I think this is just, like, a platformer. Yeah. I think you just, like, gotta do this to avoid them. I don't think there's, like, any combat in this. Which is very odd. Oops. Which is a shame, because even though this is, like, a kid's game, you could put some basic form of combat. But maybe the platforming's enough to keep it going. They actually add combat to this game later in a DLC, but it's like hyper violent. Like something out of like Hotline Miami. Goofy with a bat just beating up people. The sound is coming from behind the shrubbery. Let's take a look. Making a strange twinkling sound? Oh, now that's weird. Mickey, Minnie, Donald, Goofy. see Donald's face? You oh, hey. World of <laughs> Monoth. We are the Hawkins, and I am their leader. Is that a book on their head? Oh, I'm Goofy. Yes, I know. <laughs> Just greeted you. Oh, I remember. <laughs> Good times. Indeed. <laughs> uh, can someone please help move this conversation forward? Sure, Toku. <laughs> so, uh, are you the one who invited us here? I am. I apologize for the oh, misleading little shy. invitations, but if I told you the truth, you might not have believed me. <laughs> yes, that is what I meant by misleading. Okay. Can we have subtitles just for Donald? Please? Let's hear what Mr. Toku has to say. My curiosity is perfectly peaked. Thank you, Minnie. Well, uh, we're in desperate need of your help. Our entire world is in danger. We need heroes to save us in... We all know about your adventures. <laughs> Dueling with knights, swashbuckling as musketeers, <laughs> contesting giants high atop a beanstalk. I mean, wow. Like that oh, daisy shirt. We have done heroic things. <laughs> well, sure, but don't you want to be real heroes for a change? Yeah. Well, I think if others are in need, we should help them. And if that makes us heroes, then let's be heroes. Reason 4,897 why I love you, Minnie. Say, what are we whispering about? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us what you need, Toku. We'll help however we can. Oh, oh, thank goodness. Oh, oh, you know, I cannot tell you how relieved I am. Now, you see this magnificent yet empty bookcase? I do. Normally, it holds three tomes of knowledge. A trio of powerful magical books that contain all the wisdom of our land. Now, as long as the books are in place upon these shelves, prosperity reigns for the people of Monarch. Hang on, the books are gone. Yes, <laughs> I know. What happened? I picked a winner. The books aren't on the shelf. Oh, great.
great calamity will befall our world, and a thousand evils will rain down untold suffering and misery! Back. Well, what happened to the tomes? Evil thieves from the three biomes of Monoth have stolen them, selfishly using the magic of the tomes to further their own desires. <laughs> the violin? The world. We tried to stop them from taking the books, but you are too small and weak. I was just going to say that we failed, but Jesus, yeah, Goofy. We were too weak. Yeah, you guys fucking suck, actually. Things. We are small and weak, all right? And cranky. Mm -mm. The point is, we need help from outside heroes. And you four, well, your exploits are famous. Your bravery, legendary, and to, well, to put it simply, you're, you're just what we need, what our world needs. What do you say? Sure. <laughs> of course. You betcha. <laughs> Donald? Oh, he's out of there, dude. He wants no part of it. We can reward you handsomely. We'll do it, Toku. Oh, wonderful. You must travel to the three biomes of Monarch and retrieve the tones of knowledge. <laughs> but be prepared. It will not be easy. The thieves will not readily part with the books, but... I will teach you some magic words that will help. Words are the most powerful weapon, you know. <laughs> He's got to run the light, the projector. <laughs> These words, when spoken aloud, create a sequence that will trap the thieves. It's better than any can in hand. It's no messy cleanup. So it's like a magic spell? Yes. Just utter these words. TBD. 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 To be decided. TBD. 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 Wait, are those placeholder words or the actual words? Yes. And we can use the spell on anybody? No, just the thieves. Hmm. That seems suspiciously arbitrary. Yeah, much in like does. Oh, yes. <laughs> All we gotta do is find the thieves and use the words to trap them. That's the release yes. date for Skull and Bones. We'll Holy shit. When they're dazed. There certainly are a lot of rules. Such is the nature of magic. <laughs> say, that's a no fishing? Oh, I've got a question. Where's the picnic? No, that was a ruse. A what? No, a, 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 a ploy, a sham, a, a, a deception. Oh, are there sandwiches? There is no. <laughs> it's okay. We'll explain. Don't you worry, Toku. We won't let you down. Oh, thank you. All of you. Toku, where can we find the tomes? I do not have the exact locations. What a shock! We <laughs> believe each thing can be located within a different part of Monoth. I suggest you travel to Terrarium Town within Pavonia. Terraria? The biome to the west. This is the last known sighting of one of the tomes. I've marked the location on these mobile communication devices. Just check the Toku app. Thanks, Toku. Come on, everybody. Wait, where'd I get a banana? Wait, what? Where did I get that? That seemed to go well. Uh, this is why we need help. All right, well, there you go. We have to get some tomes. And we got tricked to come here because of a picnic. We need to get... We need to go through the Forgotten Farmlands on the other side of this gap. This jump looks pretty far. I can make it. Watch. Yep. Donald, are you okay? Let's sigh. Oh, how convenient. Let's look around the island for something to help cross this gap. If nothing else, it'll be an adventure. Some places you can't get to yet find new items to progress. Okay, so yeah, that is uh, Metroidvania 101. Ah! Tried. How big is the map? Uh, oh, this is, oh, this is like always zoomed out. All right. Glimped. Use glimpse to gain extra hearts and unlock gallery rewards in the menus. Oh, okay. Sure, man. I'm trying to find a good spot for the face cam, by the way. I might go under my health bar. Yeah. 
Those things from Metroid Dread show up? Oh, that like weird fucking stealth section in that game? That shit was so annoying. The Emmys. Uh, some places you can't get to yet. Find new items to help your, you progress. Okay, so you can't grab the ledge, I see. Can I actually, like, sprint in this? Or is it just, like... I don't know, I guess that's just my base run speed. Okay. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, just took a screenshot. I want to remember this forever. Oh, interesting. It marks, uh... Oh, it tells you all the collectibles. That's actually super nice. As expected, this game's pretty generous with uh, checkpoints. Do it again? Sorry, I can't. Can't do that to you. Uh, Yoo-hoo, hello! Oh. oh, Mazzy. Hello, sir, I'll be right with you. <laughs> I get a little lost in my own tinkering world. Can I help you with something? We're trying to get across to Pavonia. Do you know if there's a way? <laughs> Why, yes, I have just the tools for the task. Great, thanks. <laughs> What's the point of a wonderful workshop if not to help those in need? These will work splendidly. Yeah, this is only for the Switch as of right now, I believe. Uh -huh. Now then, for my new friend with the distinctive ears, a shiny short burst jetpack. Oh, oh boy, a jetpack. This will really put a vroom in my zoom. Uh -huh. Oh, they all get something. Oh, she gets a paper airplane. Uh, for Miss Botastic, an elegant bit of origami, a giant paper plane. Ooh, I love it. So sleek and aerodynamic. For you and the lovely, uh, I guess that's a sweater or a shirt. Yep. Okay. For you, a spicy pepper to fire you forward. Oh, okay. Food, fantastic. I'm starving. It's a propellant pepper, not an edible one. What does Donald get? What do I get? Oh, yes, the sailor. You have, uh, hold on. You forgot me, didn't you? Not at all. Here it is, a rather rickety, repeating rocket. Don't rockets usually explode? Now, all of you, please enjoy these inventions. They should help you navigate the treacherous terrain of Monoth. Thank you for your help. Uh, you can call me Mazzy. Thanks, Mazzy. You are welcome, and farewell, my new friends. Well, he sure was nice. You said it, let's head over to Pavonia and find Terrarium Town. He never answered my exploding rocket question. <laughs> Boost jump! Oh, there you go. Oh, I'm literally just like, I'm just on the pepper. <laughs> okay, so yeah, now we got double jump. Yeah. Can't grab the ledge, that sucks. I am riding the pepper. That's my, uh, I guess that's what I do. How does Mickey, or sorry, Minnie ride on the little airplane? Oh, boy. Now we've got a way to boost our jumps. Let's get back to the gap. Uh, where was it again? Let's open the map and have a look. It's the red flag. That arrow must be where we are now. Yeah, I got it. I got it. And this marker must be where we're going. Can't we just go home? <laughs> based, Donald. Based. No, we promised the help. Fine. Let's head back to the gap in the Forgotten Farmlands. Can I make this jump? Nah, not yet. Oh, do we get a triple jump? Is that legal? Can I grab this rope? No, I can't. All right. Ah! Can I go this way? Yeah, what's over here? Ah, this is where we drop off the shit. Okay, I see. 
This is why you get paid in advance, yeah. Or at least get half of it. Let's go! The art style in this game is super cute. It controls fine. I just wish there was, uh... Just something to do with the enemies. But, I mean, I guess it is a kid's game, so... Can't really expect too much. Oh! The flowers in the background singing, that's cool. <laughs> that's what happens when I hit down. Look at this shit. He's so excited. What the fuck? You guys ever get hyper and just get really excited and it's just like, ah, uh, you're like gyrating? The deep roots of the library. Can I like fall down here? This is probably like a ground pound or something we get later. Chat, you don't have to you don't have to play it cool. You can be honest with me. I know this is some of you when I get ready to go live. You get super excited, you're like, oh shit, Ray stream. I'm so happy. It's the best part of my day. <laughs> That's me. Oh, you can't fucking swim? You're a dog. You can't swim? Probably have to learn how to swim. Goofy, grab the ledge, please. Was he doing the doggy paddle? I didn't notice. I, I've surfed but not dive. Ooh, what is this? Uh. What is this thing? You've received token. Ooh, a collectible card. Created in monolith. Oh, guys, I got sharp pick. How many are there? Oh, there's a lot. Oh, God. 69, let's go. It's 100. How are you going to stop at 91? Just add nine more. You fuck. Oh, there is a lot. So 91 of these, 23 of these, that's 114. Oh, these are just rewards for glints. Okay, abilities, key items. Okay. Accomplishments. Oh, <laughs> you mean achievements? These are essentially achievements, yeah. Well, hey, if this game ever comes out to other platforms, here's your list. Accomplishment unlocked. <laughs> Bro, I got an achievement. I'm sorry, an accomplishment. It doesn't hit the same. It needs a cool animation like the trophies or uh, actual achievements. Better than Steam achievements? Uh, yeah, I mean, this ear infection is better than Steam achievements. Let's be honest. Find a way to travel higher. Okay. Oh, there is a thing behind my face cam that tells me what the objective is that I keep reading off. If you're wondering what I'm reading off. Uh, these are doors throughout Monoth. Okay. Oh, see you guys. Gee, do you think this is the key? One of a set of three. Full set unlocks the door. Okay. Sure, man. Oh, is that a secret over there? Is that a platform? Let's go! Oh, I got an accomplishment! What's this? I found a hidden area. Let's go. I got a bundle of memorabilia. What did I get? Oh, shit! Oh, I got Willy the Giant. Sick. You guys remember Mickey and the Beanstalk from 1947? 
I know what you're thinking. Ray, surely you know that because you were probably a kid at that time. I was not. I was born 42 years later, you fuck. I'm not that old. Yeah, who? WHO Megalol? Oh, got an accomplishment, though. Piece of history. The fuck was that? Did you guys see that? So, how do you get hearts back? Oh, is it the totally not companion cube? Yep. Okay. Sick. Another key! As far as collectibles goes, that's actually kind of cute, to be honest. Like super old, uh, Mickey Mouse shit. I do wonder what these little glints are for. I mean, they said what they're for, but, like, do I really need to be collecting these? Besides the fact that it's a kind of a platformer, so it's illegal to just run past shit. 69, by the way. Let's go. They said it increases your heart. Okay. Hearts, excuse me. Yeah, apparently there's also hidden Mickeys, but I'm not sure if there's some, like, at this point, or maybe we have to get, like, prompted about it. Like a tutorial thing. Camera? I cannot move the camera. This is like another ground pound section, maybe. Ooh, Crofty. Thank you for the Prime sub. Good Superman. Super Schwinn. Sorry, someone call on chat my fucking thigh itches. Corey, thank you guys. My wife. Hey, you're a Disney super fan. Yeah, I try to be. Who the f who the hell is Willie the Giant? Is that from um Jack and the uh the Well it's Mickey and the Beanstalk, but I think you're yeah. onto something, yeah. I have a cold medicine brain. Yeah. I was telling people that we're a fucking disaster. Oh god yeah. We're just super sick right now but not like <laughs> but like <laughs> are you looking um, it up yeah willie the, tina's looking up willie the giant right now hey, you got a yeah, breath for this guy oh i was fucking walking around outside oh it's 2000 degrees yeah sure he's from mickey's christmas carol uh it's from um he's in the i figured tinny uh, t good old tinny tina would know yeah he's in the clubhouse um, yeah, don't forget to Google Willies, chat. Yeah, if you guys want to Google giant Willies and get back to me <laughs> on Bing, let me know. Images, please. Um, all the plumbing stuff's done. Yeah. We have to replace the toilet in the guest bathroom downstairs. Why? You know how it was whistling when we flushed it? Yeah. I went again, it won't stop, and he was like, yeah, the change in pressure probably blew the gasket on it. So is he going to come back and do that? I think or? that's the last original toilet in the house, though. So <laughs> Yeah. Chad, we've been living here for a while. We've had to replace every toilet in this house at least once. Um, okay. To be fair, when he told us the thing on the street was broken, he said that was a possibility. Yeah, yeah, so, um, Okay. Well, can he do that? Yeah. he said. I said I'll call him and get it scheduled. He can't do it, like, now. That's and fine. I, like, I just want to die, so. Was it because Jamie was dropping fat logs and no. she backed it up? Don't say that. Okay. Guys, Ray, didn't, Ray dropped such fat logs, he didn't even want to use the bathroom Jamie used. True. He was like, I'm going to have to go all the way downstairs. Well, I didn't say it like that. I said, I'll go all the way downstairs. And I was like, just use that one. And he's like, that's Jamie's, that's Jamie's bathroom. bathroom. And I was like, you own the house. I do. 
It's your bathroom. I'm trying to listen, guys. I'm just, first of all, I'm trying to be an ally. All right. Um, but yeah. So, I just used, I guess, my own bathroom. Also, I can't like breathe properly. So when yeah. I do any, you look like you ran a marathon. Strenuous activity. But you were just outside in 10,000 degree heat. Yeah. All right. Go downstairs. Hang out with the pups. So I'm okay. gonna fight for a little bit. I love you. Is I love this you too. Fun. Yeah, it's cute. It's pretty simple, but obviously it's for kids, so I'm not like the target audience. But the yeah. the art and stuff is really babe. Cute. Something big's happening with Taylor this I week. I don't give a it's shit. So tell me later. Exciting. Yes, you're, you do. You're just tell me acting later. tough because you're on stream. N no, he's being gamer boy. I'm just <laughs> <laughs> gamer boy. Would she queef or something and people write articles about it? Mwah. I love you so much. I love you too. You're the best. Tell the girls oh, I love them. I got you tuna for two. So the packet's double the size. Oh, shit. Four per box? No. Oh, inside the actual pack. Okay, yeah. that's convenient. I, that's actually great. Yeah, so you only have to open the pa one packet now. I was like, tuna for two? I was going to mark it out and write tuna for Ray on it. <laughs> That'd be funny. It's funny. Yeah. Right. I love you. At least you're sick. I can kiss you now. That's I'm true. Your meds later. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. I love you. Love you, too. Little uh, cheeky Tina cameo there. Where the fuck was I going? Oh, maybe down to the right? Yep. Let's go! We are almost at 11k subs, which is pretty fucking crazy. Pretty, dare I say, gnarly. Oh no, wait. I just hit the wrong button. I still can't ground pound that. I wonder if ground pound's the next ability we're gonna get. Opens up the map a little bit more. Uh, oh, shit. There's that red flag. Stand in healing pools to restore hearts. Oh. Nice. Got, got an accomplishment, chat. Let's go. I do love a refreshing dip. Nice, dude. Nice. Is there a sub goal for 11k? No, I don't really do sub goals until December. Yeah, dude. Sometimes I do them in April, but sub goals aren't until December. I guess we do have like smaller, sillier ones, like I'll add emotes. Ah! But I don't have any planned right now. Dude, at 11,000 subs, I'll drink water. How about that? Alright, give me one second. Let me get to, like, a chill spot. Okay. Uh, ooh! Becca Prime! The 20 gifted subs! Oh, I gotta drink water! Everyone hydrate. Let's go! Hey, thank you for the very generous 20 gifted subs back at 11,000. You'll love to see it. Appreciate you. Thank you, thank you, gamers. If you got gifted a sub, enjoy your emotes. Pay it forward if you can. If not, no big deal. And thanks for hanging out today. Once again, sorry for the later stream. But, uh... Did have to go to urgent care. But thankfully, they were urgent. If you can believe, there was no one there. So... And they did care. <laughs> True. There's a hidden Mickey on what platform? A platform back here? <coughs> oh yeah, look at that! Okay, so I guess there's like no way to... Yo, good ice chat. I guess there's no way for us to like... Uh, find them? But yeah, look at that. Oh, you know what? That makes Goofy. Makes Goofy fucking excited! No, sit down. No, Goofy! He's excited! It's actually a very cool idea for a collectible in this game. They did hidden Mickeys in Kingdom Hearts 3, right? Oh, wait. Was it in all the games, or was it just 3? Ooh, I got a reward. Oh, sick! I got... Uh, that. Cool. Oh, but if I get the whole page, I get another heart. Okay. 
It was only in three, okay. Yeah, because I was like, it's not in the first one. In the first one, it's like, um, I just think you remember looking for like color, like red, green, or blue, some things to progress. Trinity symbols, yeah. Wait, is there anything down here? No. Uh, ooh. What's over here? Fuck me, I guess I'll never know. Oh no, it's more memorabilia! Oh, I assume we get like a wall jump or something later, okay. Kingdom Hearts 2 had crowns? Dude, maybe one day I'll play Kingdom Hearts 2. Oh my god. The fucking eye there was actually kind of creepy. Yeah, this is uh, some Blasphemous DLC. The game got two pieces of DLC, and one was the uh, the Disney pack. It's all on Xbox now? Uh, what, Kingdom Hearts? I believe so. In some capacity. the same like Kingdom Hearts bundle that's been on PlayStation for a while. It's all on uh It's on PlayStation, Xbox, Switch, and I think PC now. Pop. <laughs> Epic games, yeah. And the Switch versions are uh They're the cloud versions, right? jump again. Do they stay on your map? Oh, they do stay on your map. I think, right? What's the filter? What's that blue diamond? Is that just telling me where, like... <gasps> they just might be telling me where some shit is. Okay. Rip Stadia. Yeah, dude. Gone, but not forgotten. I can't reach this. Gotta love cloud versions of PS2 games. Yeah, I'd fucking... I can't imagine a cloud version of a Switch game playing well at all. But hey, maybe I'm maybe I'm wrong. The only cloud gaming I've done is um, via the Xbox and like cloud streaming to um, the Amazon. I'm sorry, the the Logitech cloud I have. And that works pretty well for the most part. It's like the closest thing to an Xbox handheld, but there's also the, um, that Asus thing that just came out. Ugh, I can't get back up there. I did not try the Ouya. Never bought one. Never seemed, uh, never seemed too interesting to me. But it's a giant meme, so I feel like I missed out. <laughs> Mazzy, it's so nice to see you again. Oh. Nice to see you too, my friend. And a little surprising, we just saw you back at the library. Oh. Yeah, she did. Strange, isn't it? Very, how'd you get here? Huh? Well, you know, I don't quite remember. Must be the years finally catching up to me. Oh, fucking preach, brother. Preach. The years do be catching up. Anyway, what can I do for you? We gotta reach Terrarium Town, but can't find a way to the top of the Forgotten Farmlands. So you need some to ascend to new heights, hmm? That will help, and that, oh my goodness, certainly that. The problem's not your jumping prowess, it's your ability to cling to vertical surfaces. Fortunately, I have just the curious creation to help. For my red short shorted friend. The pen may be mightier than the sword, but a giant pencil can draw new conclusions. Oh boy, oh boy I get the point. 
she gets a goddamn what? She gets a professional climbing tool and Mickey got a pencil? For my professionally climb or professional climber with a polka dot personality, a professional climbing tool. That's certainly spot on. Is Donald gonna get fucked again? I got a fork! Bro, Minnie got professional climbing equipment. I got a fork. What the fuck? For the gent in the green hat, the best way to serve the situation is a giant fork. <laughs> oh, my tummy's rumbling already. What does Donald get? And for my nautical friend? Yeah, what do I get? A plunger. Bro, he wants to fuck Minnie. He's giving her the good shit. What better way to stick to stuff? But the others are so... Fine, just give it to me. Donald, I got a fork, all right? Mickey got a pencil. Now go, my friends, and reach the gates of Terrarium Town. The views are beautiful. What's up, Joey? What a great pal. Always there just when you need him. A plunger. Fooey. Bro, I got a fork. Hey, we can wall jump. Another accomplishment. Walls can't stop you now. I guess I can go back, right? Go all the way back around. Let's see. That's true. You know, I can eat with a fork. Oh, yeah. That's self-explanatory. Okay. Aha! Can't decide if you want to get high on life or exoprimal. I mean, they're both on Game Pass. Try them both. Also depends. You want to play single player or multiplayer? I will say, I don't have a lot of time in exoprimal, but there is no Pickle Rick yet. Don't know if that alters your purchase decision, but figure I'd just give you a heads up. What's the fucking point? That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. Buyer beware. I wonder if they ever fixed those fucking achievements in High on Life. I think a couple of them were like... Maybe not glitch, but like buggy. And like... Very annoying to get. I never finished High on Life. Originally, I didn't plan on finishing High on Life, but people really wanted me to finish it, so uh, I ended up doing it, and then the video got uh, age-gated, so... Or uh, part one got age-gated. This is where I went before, but I'm just seeing if there's anything I missed. But now we have a highlight, so thankfully right now the highlight's doing okay. Bunga butt, thank you for the 34. Alright, who do we get? Oh! Oh, we got Mickey Mouse in a jar. Well... The outline of Mickey Mouse. Where, where, where is he? It's just his hat, his pants, and his shoes. You are my dad. 1928. Bro, Walt put Mickey Mouse in a jar almost 100 years ago? All right, Walt, I see you, you freaker. Yeah, Stop putting things in jars. The internet has ruined it. True. When T and I went to go see the Barbie movie yesterday. Great movie, by the way. Uh, there was a trailer for the new Wonka movie, which kind of looks whatever, but uh, Oompa Loompa's in a jar, and I'm just like, don't. What are we doing? Someone on the team has to know. What's going on, Harvey? Hello, fellow ear infection king. Oh, man. If you have an ear infection as well, I'm so sorry. Huzzah! Oh, shit. Right. Keep forgetting these guys bite me. Oh, I got Cyclone. Cool. Sick. All right. Look at us getting some collectibles. Both the dogs are sleeping on me and I forgot my tissues. Oh, babe. You're stuck there. I'm sorry. Do you want me to get them for you? That way you don't have to move and the dogs can stay put. You could wait a bit. Okay. You get ear infections a lot? That sucks. I'm sorry. This is my first one ever. Good old swimmer's ear. All 
Alright, so we're just still booking it to the left. It's because I used to be a bath guy. Oh, hell yeah. Alright, so we can go back, yeah, to the left. There's a bunch of shit we can grab. Alright, yeah, fuck it. Let's go grab it. Harvey sold his water. Yep. Nice. This music is very intense. Who do we get? Oh, uh, we got Mazzy. Oh, we got number 67. So close. Ooh, ending. Thank you for the 100-month resub. Thank you so much. Hope you're doing well. My dog's got ear infections. He was always so sad. Dude, fucking Charlie had an ear infection for a while. I don't know how she got hers. I assume just by rolling around the dirt outside, but... Pop, pop. Oh, we got a <laughs> We got the sandwich. Let's go. We unlocked the sandwich. <laughs> Huge. <laughs> Goofy's first love. What did he fuck the sandwich in 2015? Yeah. Oh, Jarmos, that sucks, man. Well, at least you have an icebreaker for conversations. Goofy was down bad in 2015. Dude, weren't we all? Whoops. Nishu, how are you? Oops. Can we get uh, any double jumpers in chat? There we go. the right way? Yeah. All right. Who do we get? Oh. Oh, wow. That L is hard to see. Clock Cleaner Mickey. 1937. Good old Clock Cleaner. Anyone? And anyone big fans of Clock Cleaner Mickey? The L is doing a lot of heavy lifting. Yeah, that L is Atlas, actually, holding up the word. All right, uh, we got everything over here, I guess, so uh, let's keep going. Can you, like, switch characters on the fly? I mean, I think they all play the same, but no, I don't think you can. I think you'd have to go to the, uh... Oh, player? No, okay. Well, that's nice. Starting health, you could change. Jump assist, wall, cling assist. Okay. Oh, I wonder if you can get this shit early. Is that what that means? Hold on. So you turn that on. Oh, yeah, you have this, like, this little, what looks like a Cheeto following you. Interesting. I just turned that off. We do be loving accessibility options. Leland, how are you? Welcome on in, man. <laughs> Cheeto. All right, uh, so back up we go. We go up to the right. 
I played a game recently called Fall of Porcupine that had a huge list of options uh, for people with color blindness. I remember when that was like added to like Call of Duty. That was like a big deal. I don't know how many different like I don't know what you would say versions of uh oh it's collectible other oh, shit down there fuck of color blindness there are but it seems like there's always at least like three. So I'm not sure if those are like the three main ones, but I feel like I see the main three a lot. <laughs> Did they call it woke? No, this was years ago, so people were uh, like, oh, that's nice. Is there? Am I missing, like, things here? Or did I just get them? Oh, maybe I'm losing my mind. I thought there was something on the map. Maybe I just grabbed them, didn't even notice. All right. You seen people shit talk Grounded's arachnophobia setting? Fucking, I hate people. They did something similar in, uh, Star Wars. Fallen Order. Or Fallen Survivor, whatever the latest one was. They had, um, something like that. Oh no, yeah, what the fuck? But if I zoom in, it's not there. Weird. Hmm, $40 game, by the way. It was Jai Survivor. Hogwarts had it too, yeah. Listen, accessibility options are great, man. I don't understand why people would, uh, poo-poo them for any reason. Obviously, you don't need to use them uh, at all. In fact, it's probably a majority of it's not for you. So why the fuck do you care? Also, honestly, for achievement and trophy hunters, honestly, uh, accessibility options are sometimes uh, kind of base because they make things much easier. <laughs> Uh, ooh, should I go back to the right? Nah, we'll climb up top. The only reason I have, uh, Celeste completed is because you can use accessibility options. And it's like, well, I'm pretty fucking bad at this game, so... I'm cheating. Well, I guess not really cheating. I'm abusing accessibility options. I think people were mad about that on TA, because TA is full of babies sometimes. Because it's a super hard completion, but the TA score got ruined because you can use <laughs> accessibility options. Oh, we got Slick! Hell yeah. I think Uncharted 4 and Spider-Man had... I know Spider-Man had accessibility options. They had something where you could press a button and skip the puzzles. I'm not sure if that counts as accessibility or just like a gameplay thing, but I loved it. Because I was able to just skip all the puzzles. I'm like, I don't care about this shit. I just want to play Spider-Man because it's super fun. Can they skip the Mary Jane sections? Um, because I hate women. <laughs> no, because they were really boring stealth sections. I guess they were there to like break up the game, but I'm like, it, this Spider-Man game is real good. You don't really need to break this up. Ooh, Fluttercly. Not to be confused with Fluttershy, the worst pony. Oh, who's this guy? Hey, man. Jito? Jido? Uh, hello, you look new to the wonderful biomes of Monoth. We are. Can I interest you in one of my map pieces? That would be fantastic, but I'm afraid we don't have anything to buy them with. That's okay, I don't sell them. They're free. Where's the butt? Oh, right here, Donald. Um, At the top of my legs? Oh, Goofy! Yes! Goofy and I are on the same page. Let's go! There are no butts. Oh, should have said my tushy. I just love making maps and handing them out to the wonderful folks who find me. Look for me throughout Monoth. And I'll give you a new meat piece of the area. Why can't you just give us all of them now? Where's the fun in that? You're right. What was I thinking? <laughs> Thanks, pal. We'll see you soon. So that's bread, right? That's bread? <laughs> Reveals a section of the map from beneath the fog. 
Oh, damn, that's a big-ass chunk. Okay. Oh, accomplishment unlocked. Hey-ho, Jito. Nice. So does that actually show you where... Okay, it doesn't show you collectibles or anything. You just uh, have to find them on your own. Okay. Okay. Does this count as a hidden Mickey? This is kind of like in your face, right? But maybe. I still have no way to like claim them. The other one on the platform was pretty good. Unrelated, guys. Hope you guys sign up for my Accomplishment Hunter website. I'm starting tomorrow. Do you think there's one on Mickey's head? Oh, shit. I'll have to pay attention to that. I don't even know what this enemy is. Is it just, like, noise? Like, what are we... Alright, well, see ya. Let's go, I got burner emails. Hell yeah. Does anyone have a burner Twitch Prime account? Asking for a friend. It's me, I'm the friend. Do, 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 do. Excuse me. Fuck. I'll ask Jeff Bezos for one, thank you. His name is Jeff. Do you think he's heard that one before? Do you think Jeff Bezos has fired anyone for going up to him and saying, Your name is Jeff. Uh, we'll go, we'll go left. He promoted them, oh shit. Let's go. Oh, we got a new reward. Oh, I hate all the eyes on that thing. Fucking really hate that. Okay. Do you think Jeff Bezos watched that movie? 22 Jump Street? He seems like the kind of guy that has all the money in the world but would still probably torrent a movie. So he probably saw it but torrented it. YouTube Frog checking in. Thank you very much. Uh, Alar. Hopefully I said that right. Welcome back. Shout out to the frogs. Shout out to Goofy not grabbing this ledge still. I like the backflip you can do with Goofy. It's like SM64. You're a Pokemon card, Frog. Maybe we'll open up packs again. I did get an email from someone, a very nice email, that was wondering if I had any extra bulk to uh, give away because they're a teacher and they want to use it for, like, rewards for their kids, but I gave my bulk away already. And I don't, I don't open nearly as much as I used to. I still do have the email saved, so whenever I open cards again, I can give them uh, extras. Drop another 30k on cards. I think doing that once in my lifetime is enough. Isn't it crazy? Like, think of all the packs we got for 30k. Isn't it wild that if you get older packs, 30k is maybe, I don't know, like three or four boxes? <laughs> maybe less? Oh, I didn't see what we got. Fuck, I hit it too late. Um, Was it here? Oh, no, I think it was a it was a token, right? Um, Who's new? Oh. No, no, we got that one. Got you. We got you. Oh! Riff, riff Rab. You can get Maddie two horses for that amount. Oh, listen, I love Maddie. I don't love buy her a horse. Oh. 30k spent, by the way. Still don't have the big fat gay Pikachu. Actual cringe. 
Can I bullshit this? No, I have to go down to the left. But yeah, I can see us doing another one. Another one pretty soon. Especially with uh, whenever the 151 comes out. The art in that set looks incredible. Maddie, I'm sorry Ray is such a bad friend. Bro! What do you mean? Uh, I jumped right into that. Actual idiot. <laughs> Missed it. Gamer. Am I, I don't think I've found the door yet for this. I think I found the door for these keys. Myson, thank you for the 46. This is the same genre of game as Ori. It is a Metroidvania, but it's a lot more simplistic and there's no combat. So you're kind of just platforming around and avoiding enemies. Pop. Uh, I wonder if the door is to the right by this uh, mailbox over here. I'm going to assume so because I don't know what that blue line thing is. I like the art style on this as well. Am I liking the game so far? Yeah, it's cute. It's chill. I mean, I'm not the demographic for this. I do wish there was some kind of combat or engagement, but it's a very chill, relaxing game. You could play with up to four people as well, so it's a good for uh, it's good for kids and people who like maybe haven't played too many video games before. And it looks like it would be an easy completion if it came out on uh, other platforms. But as of right now, it's only on the Switch. Yeah, I'm surprised you can't, like, even, like, stomp on enemies. You can't stomp on... Koopas! Like Chris Pratt did back in the day. Can't wait till Donald gets a gun. That's true, we are early on. I think it was Kevin that says this game actually just turns into hatred later on, so we'll see. But yeah, it, it's a fun game. It looks good. The The cutscenes are actually pretty funny. And it's not full price. It's only uh, $40. I just want to show the game off a little bit. I have like, this is going to be a, a one-time stream. But yeah, I'm enjoying it. We've only been playing for a little over an hour, so. Ooh, what's happening here? Gorsh, no one's been through these gates in a long time. <gasps> yeah, looks like it's been at least a hundred years. That sounds about, huh? Look at this Giga Chad. Hello, and who might you be besides an eavesdropper? The name's Dex, and entering uninvited is what I do. Bro, you really just said that? What the fuck? Are you a are you a burglar? A burglar? Not at all. I would never be a burglar. I'm a smuggler. No. Oh, that's much better. Hey, sarcasm. I like that. What are you doing at that weird looking thing? I'm looking for the old smugglers tunnels to get into uh, Terrarium Town. A smuggler who doesn't know where the smugglers tunnels are. You need to get a different career. Nope, smuggling's in my blood. My uncle was a smuggler before he went legitimate. Could you ask your uncle where the tunnels are? I tried. Problem is Uncle Steve. <laughs> Uncle Steve. Uh, Uncle Steve doesn't approve of me following in his footsteps. Uh -huh. Although he might tell you. Saw that coming. Uh -huh. You could ask him where the smugglers tunnels into Terrarium Town are. Uh, we do need to find a way into Terrarium Town. Just head to Gizmo uh, Gizmopolis. Gizmopolis? Can't fucking read. Yeah. Then the service tunnels in downtown. I've marked your map. No way. That's too long a walk. 
Oh, sarcasm again. I love it. I'll give you a key card for the smuggler's entrance of Gizmoopolis. You can also use it to take a different route through the farmlands. Oh, yeah, that door. Oh, a pink key card? Let's go. <laughs> Thank you, Dex. We'll see you soon. A key card that opens smuggler's doors. I like his little uh, picture on it. Yeah, this is where Gizmo lives. Let's go. Oh, I think this thing here is... Um, I think I saw this in the trailers originally. You get, like, a rope. You can, like, swing across. I'm in! Hacker voice. Kick it up there. Nah. All right. Hmm. I guess I'll go up if I can. Oh, I need the ground pound. Fuck. You gotta visit Minecraft City for Uncle Steve to go to Terraria Town. Dude. New head cannon just dropped, guys. Big shout out again to Glasses for finding uh, good pictures of my Minecraft house so I can make that stupid tweet earlier. That's why I pay her the big bucks. I was uh, extremely lazy to find it myself. So, you know, that's why you just pay people to do shit like that for you. For my Mojo Dojo Casa House tweet, yeah. I told Tina about it uh, earlier in the day, and she's like, that's a good tweet. I'm like, hell yeah. And then I realized I don't want to look for that, so uh, I'll have glasses <laughs> to it. Oh, yeah, they're called Zeets now. Well, actually, on my on my phone, I still have basic Twitter. I'm not sure if, <laughs> when it's going to change, but for me, it's still tweets. On, like, desktop, it's uh, X or whatever. But on my phone, it's still, still Twitter. Let me see if it's still like that now. Uh, yeah, it's still Twitter right now. Any day now, though. It's going to happen. I won't be able to stop it. No, I can't make it up there. Fuck, give me the ground pound, dude. Okay, so I think a blue question mark on your map just signifies, like, there's something over there to get. What a stupid fucking name, X. Elon Musk is so stupid. What an idiot. Proto Skittles, how's it going? Yeah, I got an ear infection in my left ear. It, uh, it's not great. I'm being very brave right now. Mr. Blade, hello, hello, how are you? Thought I could fucking make it. That's what I get. Ooh, glint reward. It's a bird! I wonder if there's boss fights in this. I want to at least play to get to a boss fight so I can see what that looks like with no, uh, <laughs> with no combat. Uh, let's go over here. I guess there are, like, puzzle bosses and stuff. Oh, I can't do it. Oh my god, look at all this! What the fuck? Look at that! That actually looks challenging! Yeah, this is a goofy pacifist run. Ooh, there's 
There's some down there, but there's also something up here. Who do we get? We got a bucket. Let's go. Bucket, bucket, bucket. Huge. My mom said feel better too. Oh, hell yeah. Tell her I say thank you. I will. My wife's taking care of me. I'll be all good. The classic Disney icon. <laughs> Hit Mickey. Oh, can I get the thing down here? No, right. This is something different. Oh, never mind. Yes, I can. All right. Who do we get next? Peg Leg Pete. I like the little, uh, how they kind of look like a puppet. Or like they're sewn together. Dude, we almost have Steamboat Willie completed. Yummy Rocks. Hello. How are you? Welcome to the stream. Uh, we keep going to the right. Yeah, I know. The jar was back on screen. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. There's nothing I could do about that, chat. Smuggler's uncle, are you here? Oh, wait, I can get something up here. I love the way Goofy is animated, same. The way the characters are animated and, like, their silly walk cycles and stuff are, are pretty nice. Actually, how high can I go here? Aha! I do like how I stab the fork in the wall every time, too. Ah, uh, what's this way? Oh, health. Nice. <coughs> Shades of Cuphead? Well, definitely not that, that... Not that kind of animation style. That, um... Oh my god, what's it called? Rubber hose? Kind of style, but... For what they were going for, I think it looks great. The no combat thing is really a bummer. Because it is kind of, uh... It is kind of bland. You just want to, like, I don't know. Like, getting abilities and stuff and, and collecting things is nice, but... Yeah, I do wish there was a way to engage with the enemies. Besides just avoiding them. <laughs> Kiss the enemies. Dude, make love, not war. Start fucking smooching all of them. Ooh, enter the admin building. It'll be fine if it had his achievements. What do you mean, dude? We got accomplishments. Where are they? Bro, they got achievements right here. Put some respect on the accomplishments. How, da how dare you? Uh, we'll go up and around. Unlike Barack Fu. That shit was so weird to me. Like, it had trophies, but it just never got achievements on Xbox. Oh, whoops. Then again, the, we're talking about a, a Shaq Fu sequel. I don't think anyone really expected much from that. <laughs> I 
I bought so much gold bond. Shaq Fu did happen. It was this, well, that was Shaq Fu 2. A Hero Reborn, I think it's called, or some shit. Still really upset it wasn't called Shaq 2. They fucked up on that. We got the broom! Isn't the broom and bucket thing from, like, Fantasia? Or some shit? But yeah, that was, uh, that was a dumb game. It was, uh, it was worth playing, though. I had a good time with it, as silly as it was. And I think we were the second or third person to complete it on Xbox. Uh, we do have a highlight for that if you want to watch. I think it's like 20 minutes, 30 minutes long. It's not, it's not too long. Compared to my normal, uh, the normal length of the uh, videos on my channel. Conquer. Thank you for the prime. YouTube Frog says hello. Hello, Conquer, and hello to all the YouTube Frogs. <laughs> have I gotten world first? I have. I have a list on TA. I think it's only six, five or six games? It's only like five or six games, and one of them has an asterisk because I got an early code for it. Can I get this right now? Oh, I need the, uh... I need the blue thing. Your highlights are always fun to watch. Thanks, man. The highlight for uh, July is looking pretty good. Light gave me the uh, light gave me the the first draft. It's I think close to an hour and a half. If you can believe it, a lot of it's cursed Halo. Cursed Halo is a good chunk. But we've also played a lot of uh, other games this month, so. Uh, I did complete the second ukulele game. Uh, I was world first, and I finished at like 5 a.m. because I wanted to be world's first. I really, really liked that game. Can I go down? Uh, I guess I could, but we'll keep going this way. Game looks whack. Using whack in the year of our Lord 2023. It's kind of based, actually. Yeah, it's, I mean, it's intended for kids. And it's not, uh... <coughs> There's no combat. But it's pretty chill. I mean, I don't, I don't hate it. Ukulele slap. Ukulele 2. Slap. Ukulele 1. It was alright. I know people, like, really hated that game, but... I wasn't... I wasn't too bad on it, too sour on it. Ooh, that looks important. Bum, bum, bum. I wonder if they'll make another ukulele game. And if they do, what style will be in? Because they did a 3D platformer, 2D platformer. Dude, fucking cart racer. Uh, actually, never mind. I don't think there's that many <laughs> ukulele characters to fill out a, a cart uh, game roster. Uh, ooh, there's a key up there. Oh, did I miss a bell? Some oh, the bell's up there, you fucking blind idiot. My name's in the credits for the ukulele one as a Kickstarter. Barack Obama 69? Did Michelle let you do that? Hell yeah. Pop. That was urgent care. Uh, pretty quick. There was nobody there, if you can believe it. We were in and out in about like 20 minutes, which I think is pretty fast for urgent care. Wasn't too bad. They pretty much confirmed it was an ear infection and uh, prescribed me some medicine. T 
Tina was like, we'll go after the stream. And I'm like, can we just go now to get it over with? And I'm glad we did. Just to get it out of the way. Oh, not another fucking jar. Come on, dude. Stop putting people in jars. Or at least outfits in jars. Jesus. Uh, they did not suck any liquid out. I'm so sorry. Sorry to let you down. Uh, we'll go to the left. Bum, bum, bum. Oh shit. I wonder if thing ha this thing has the thing that uh, New Super Mario Brothers does, where if you're playing with four people, someone can like put themselves in a bubble or some way to protect themselves so you can play without them and make progress. That seems like something this game would have. That reminds me, I'm so upset that uh, Super Mario Wonder is only local co-op and not online. Feels bad, man. Feels bad. I am super excited for Super Mario Wonder, um, but I would have loved to be able to play it online. Oh, there's a door up there. They know the Switch Online could handle it. Oh, we got the last guy. Siege. The creation and maintenance of Moon Juice products. What the fuck is Moon Juice? Hell yeah. Can I get some? Will that make me feel better? <laughs> Don't say Disney lean. <laughs> Anyway, yeah, uh, Super Mario Wonder does look real fucking fun, real good. I'm very excited to play it. <coughs> That's what you squeeze out of moon balls? Oh. Yikes. Uh, where was that door? Oh, way over there. Okay. Boom. Boom, boom, boom. Is there anything that I missed that I can grab? Probably not, because all this shit is like abilities I don't have yet. Mazzy, where are you? I need your abilities. Hello! Ooh, Piku! The $5 tip raise a self-employed person. How does health insurance work? Oh, you apply for it every year. I forgot what the cutoff date is. Um, you just, you just have to apply for it. You gotta buy it yourself. Here at Brown Man LLC, which I think is what my business is still called, we don't believe in health insurance. Get your own, you fucking freeloader. Unrelated, I think I'm the only official employee at Brown Man LLC. Uh, can I make it to the right? I don't think so. Does Twitch not provide insurance? <laughs> Absolutely fucking not. Fucking. I know we had a comedian in chat. No, they don't. Um. 
Ooh, what was that? Gorge. Uh, I must be hungry. My tummy's never rumbled that loud before. That's not your stomach, Goofy. Oh boy. This seems like a big drop. I'm not going down there. I'll go first. <gasps> Minnie! <gasps> Wait for me! Oh. Right behind you. Oh, what's, what's Donald have again? This is the last time I jump into a potentially bottomless pit. Oh, yes, a little rocket. Oh, there's that rumbling again. Are you sure it's not my tummy? Pretty hungry. You. Oh, is this a boss? Oh, we're finally gonna see a boss. You have been inaccurately routed. Huh. Routed? Who said that? This does look like <laughs> a stage for a platform fighter. This game turns into a fucking Final Destination all of a sudden. Or the level turns into Final Destination. I know why you're here. You will not take the tome. Oh. Mickey, they have one of those tombs. It's time for you. It's time to return you yeah. to sender. Give us the tomb and we can end this now. Mm. No, the tomb stays with me. And the other show remain with my sisters. Ooh. Wait, you're all related? <gasps> well, no, not literal sisters. More like spiritual ones. Okay. The point is the books are staying with us and we will fight to keep them. Please, if you give us the tome, there won't be any trouble. Well, there might be a little trouble. This is the end of your delivery route. And postage is due. Oh, great. We're about to get stamped. All right. So let's see how this works. Shen, one day I'll get you, Ray. Bro, what do you mean? Also, Shen, I was telling chat earlier, when you sent me that message, I had no idea what you were talking about. Um, with Final Fantasy, like I didn't hear the Xbox news. I thought you were just yelling at me to play it again. And then I found out later, I'm like, oh shit, wait a minute. <laughs> Cause I was, uh, I had to go to urgent care. So I kind of missed some stuff. And then I'm like, oh, that makes sense. That is kind of cool though. It's actually kind of huge for Xbox because I thought I thought Squeenix was all in on uh, PlayStation with Final Fantasy stuff. By the way, this is the uh, the boss fight. If you can believe it, it's uh, just jumping on shit. I'm generally shocked. Yeah, I saw uh, I saw a clip of Phil Spencer on the screen, and I'm like, holy shit, Uncle Phil went? Damn, dude. All right. Was Final Fantasy 15 on Xbox first? Is that true? Fuck, I didn't even know that. But that is true. <coughs> Phil shook my dad Yoshi P's hand. Dude, my uncle shook your dad's hand. And then they made out. Or did I dream that? Oh, it was on Xbox at the same time? Oh, that, that makes more sense. I'm like, I can't imagine a world where a Final Fantasy game comes out on Xbox first. Rule of three? Rule of three? Oh, I guess rule of three until the next, next phase. All right. Have people come around on Final Fantasy XV? Because I remember people fucking hated that game when that game came out. But then I hear, I hear people, like, reminisce about, like, the boy band journey. I've never played it. All I know is, uh, four dudes in a car. That, that's the extent of my knowledge on Final Fantasy XV. <laughs> I love it, but it's got issues. Eh, but all games do. Not, there's not really many games you could say are perfect. What's up, Vials, by the way? Crown! Thank you for the four years. Shen, I hope you, uh, hope you appreciated my Waka reference. Final Fantasy X is the only game I've finished and really played a lot of, so I can only make Final Fantasy X references because that's all I know. And it's mainly just Waka because he's such an absurd character that I love him.
played 10 a long... Sure did, I played 10 a long time ago, but never got to finish it because my disc broke. Ah, rip. It's a fun game. I mean, I'm not a big RPG guy, unless it's Pokemon or Yakuza, but I really liked it. Just classic turn-based shenanigans. Good cast of characters, good soundtrack. Game made me cry. So, there's that. How do I get this one? I have to climb on the wall, I do. Pop. One day we'll get him one day. Maybe when this thing comes out to Xbox, I'll, I'll, I'll play it on an alt account and see how I like it. Because many people have told me the game controls pretty well on a controller. So... I can't even imagine what the achievements are like in Final Fantasy XIV. I'm sure they take at least a thousand hours. We beat him. Her. Even a lot of PC players use controller? Oh, that's interesting. Someone in chat said they did. Uh, you won't get away with this. Quick, everyone, the spell. TBD! 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 You may have bested me, but the other two won't be. Oh my god! We turned him to stone? Won't be as what? Do you think she was going to say as difficult? Or as annoying? God damn, we just actually killed somebody. Theories of efficiency. The Tome of Engineering. The first tome. Just two more before we can return them all to Toku and the Hokans. And be heroes. And have our picnic. Our what? Our picnic. You know, the whole reason we came to this island? Oh, Donald. That was too long ago for a call back. <laughs> Got an accomplishment. Gonna be honest, I don't want to ruin my own game. But yeah, I don't think you would enjoy Final Fantasy XIV. Well, I don't really like MMOs. That's not that's not like Final Fantasy's fault. I just don't really fuck with MMOs too often. I don't really stick with one game that long because of my years of achievement hunting. I bounce around a lot. <coughs> but it could be cool to just try out. I don't really like Final Fantasy XIV for the first 70 hours. That's crazy. That's a long time to sit through something if you don't like it. Do, 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 do. All right, since we finally did a boss, I think we'll play for a little bit more. I'm going to see this, like, smuggling area. And then uh, we can take it from there. Maybe go back to just chatting for a little bit. Because I feel like we've seen everything the game has to offer. I mean, the lack of combat is kind of a shame. But I assume it's just more of what we've been doing. The boss fight was at least a little interesting. A little challenging. Nothing too crazy, but... Yeah, I mean... You kind of... You know... Get what you get with this game. It's not trying to really be anything too crazy. This is very clearly uh, intended for... Oh my god. Intended for a younger audience. Or people who aren't uh, as adept at video... Oh! Adept at video games like me, apparently. What'd I get? Hulkin! Beer, 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 beer. Ooh, we got a raid. Thank you. I played the first Kingdom Hearts. I played it as a kid, and I played it recently, and it was a sub goal. I had a good time with it. You know, just a silly RPG that I can't tell you what happened, but it was fun hitting things with a keyblade. Maybe one day I'll play another one. Chain of Memories is next. True. I, I hear it's the best one. Too bad they never made a third one. Oh, dude, same. Can't believe they skipped Resident Evil 6 and Yakuza 5 as well. I don't understand why companies just skip numbers in their games. It's very confusing. I can go this way. Yeah, Dead Rising 4. Yeah, Capcom has this thing where they're just like, 
we're ending a series here. Or we're going to skip a number. Wild. Oh, hidden Mickey. If that counts as hidden. <laughs> Hello, Mega Man. I'm feeling a little bit better. <clears throat> At least you didn't fall down hard like I did. What do you mean? I gotta go over there to the left. A Dead Rising remake would be cool. I know that's rumored and I would love that, but we'll have to see. Old Man Bell Ringer. Chad, he looks just like me. We're like twins. Yeah, everyone follow Shen if you haven't already. Please and thank you. I did not grab the fucking bell. Yeah, dude. Splinter, thank you for the 29. Is this game good? Uh, it's only really okay. It's very simplistic. I'd say the worst part of the game is the fact that there's no combat. But I like the art style. The voice acting is nice. And the platforming's fun. There's just not enough variety in the gameplay. I think even for a game for kids, like, you could implement some form of combat, you know, like. Kids are smart enough to figure out how to, like, <laughs> hit things. I feel like it's a little maybe too basic. Which is a shame. Pop. But yeah, we just did a boss fight as well, and even the boss fight was uh, all platform, no combat. If this ever comes out to Xbox or PlayStation, or PC if you're into Steam achievements, it will be an easy completion, though. You just gotta go around and collect everything. The game is very generous where telling you stuff is on the map. But as of right now, it's only on the Switch. It is only $40, so it's not a full price game. If you have like a young, a young kid or a, a little brother, little sister, niece, nephew, one of those things, I think you could have fun with them. Oh, interesting. Oh, I gotta ring that one. I see. Whoops. This also seems like a game that maybe might go on sale. Maybe like a Black Friday kind of thing or Cyber Monday or Boxing Day. It is co-op, it's four player co-op. I think it's drop in, drop out, but I actually don't know. <coughs> Excuse me. But yeah, I've been playing for a little over an hour and a half, and I feel like we've seen everything the game has to offer already. I don't know how long the game is. Um, but yeah, I feel like we've seen everything already. Yeah, no subtitles in the... Uh, voice acted cutscenes is an, is a weird choice. Oh, whoops. That was stupid. I have no thoughts on Pikmin 4. I played Pikmin 1 and I'm like, alright, sure. I enjoyed Pikmin 1, but I have no interest in playing the other ones anytime soon. Oh, shit. Don't want to do that. Fuck, I'm going to go all the way back for this, even though it doesn't matter. The people who play Pikmin really fucking like Pikmin 4, so that's good. Hopefully, uh, the next Pikmin game doesn't take... What is it, like, fucking five years to come out? Or, I'm sorry, ten years to come out, right? It's like a really long gap between three and four. Ten years, yeah. Something really cool is you can play all the mainline games, all the mainline Pikmin games on the Switch. So. Pikmin fans eating good. All right, we have to make our way back up to that door.
Yeah, Pokemon Sleep came out. I'm I'm not really too interested in Pokemon like I guess spin-offs, so I'm not really too interested in it. But people seem to be using it. I don't know how well it works as like a sleep thing, like a sleep app, or if people are just playing it because, you know, Pokemon. But you could shiny hunt in it. I know that much. Like, I was never really into Pokemon Go and, you know, any of the other, like, silly games they had, like Magikarp Jump, for example. I just like playing the vanilla Pokemon games. Might have a better chance getting a shiny Shaman. Yeah, no fucking kidding, dude. Nah, dude, tomorrow. Tomorrow's the day we're finally gonna get it, I promise. 100 gifted subs, I don't get it. That's how confident I am. Even though I did that last time and I still didn't get it. But tomorrow's the day. Ouch. Tomorrow's the day. I just don't even know what I would shiny hunt after, uh, after that. Like, I guess I could go back to Froakie on Scarlet and Violet, but I don't even really play Scarlet and Violet anymore. Go back to Sword and Shield. Shiny hunt in there. I missed the bridge. Yeah, but then we gotta play Scarlet and Violet. It's true. Just wait for the DLC. <laughs> Whoop! Or PLA, that's true. Could go back to PLA. Oh, there is a free Grim Snarl. Free shiny Grim Snarl, I think, that's out right now. I should probably redeem. But yeah, now I if I remember, that's the only <laughs> only reason I boot up Scarlet and Violet for the free Pokemon. I don't even do the raid dens anymore. Token! We got Jerry or Jerry. I'm excited for the DLC. I'm, I am excited for the DLC. I'm mainly excited for, like, the new Pokemon at this point. The best part about seeing the new Pokemon is knowing that in the future, these cool Pokemon will be added to fan games and ROM hacks that run better and probably are more fun. <laughs> Ooh, I'm gonna go right. Shiny Hunt Pokemon Showdown. Hey, listen, we got a shiny in uh, Pokemon Stadium, sort of, kind of, that saved the run. <laughs> Base shiny Poliwag, I know. Uncle Steve, we found him. Come on, work, will you? Cool. Pardon me, but are you Uncle Steve? <gasps> yes, and please call me Uncle Steve. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that was stupid. Oh, I thought I did. Sorry. Uncle Steve's only joking. Uncle Steve's a funny guy. You're funny, all right. Uncle Steve, we just met Dex in the Forgotten Farmlands. He said you might be able to tell us where the smuggler's tunnels are. Oh, no, you as well? It's not what it sounds like. We don't want to be smugglers. We just want to use the tunnels to get somewhere that's locked. Well, Uncle Steve can show you where they are, but it won't help you. The entrance of those tunnels is sealed over by hard rock. Is there any way to break up the rock? The only way would be with a cannon. Can't believe I'm hearing this. If we didn't have a cannon, would there be another way? Well, you would have to generate a huge downward force like a piano falling out of a window. Oh, he gives us the ground pound. I'm not sure where we'll find something like that, but we'll find a way. Sorry, Uncle Steve couldn't be more help. That's all right. We appreciate you showing us the location. Gosh, what's this machine for? Oh, this? It controls Monos mail rails and teleporters. Is it broken? It was, but Uncle Steve has just started to get it working again. Well, if you ever need anything, just let us know. Or someone that isn't us. You're funny. Uh, you're funny, too. Uncle Steve's a fan. I guess this is where you would get the, the sliding shit and whatnot. Find a large downward force. Yeah, then we just go over here, get the ground pound, and yeah. 
All right, we'll get the ground pound and then we'll just, we'll just wrap it up there. Like I said, I think we've seen everything the game has to offer and I think I'm pretty much done with it. Is that a hidden Mickey? Yeah, dude. Oh, shit. All right, Steve. Steve says yes. Oh, sock puppets. No, I don't think you could swap characters, but they all play this. I just took a picture, fucking idiot. Um, I think they all play the same, to be honest. I think it's more of a, just like an aesthetic thing. Oh, you can't go back this way, huh? Like we have, um... Yeah, we have like two of the seven abilities and we're missing like a bunch of key items, but... Yeah, the game isn't interesting enough for me personally to keep going. Can I keep going down? Was that blocked off? Realize I'm going up. I'm supposed to be going down. Oh, I have to go up and around. I see. Yeah, they're right there. It is what it is. Yeah, I mean, you know, you're not going to love every game. And this game is obviously not meant for old men like me. It's not, it's not made for geriatrics. Music's kind of hidden, though. Kind of reminds me of, like, Mario Galaxy a little bit with the orchestra. Wait, did I just hit that enemy and I didn't get... Took no damage? What the fuck? All right. The collectible uh, memorabilia is cool. Ow. But the... Um, The, like, random pictures we were getting is just, like, uh, okay, I guess. Who do we get? Oh, we got the harp. Sexy harp, let's go. Oh, no! I actually died. So, do I just go back to, like, the... Oh, that's a cute little... <laughs> that's a cute little screen. Yeah, I just go back, like, two feet, because there's checkpoints everywhere. I know, dude, the harp got them curves. Oops. Yeah, dude. All right, Mazzy, for the last time, give me the booty bounce. Ooh. Mazzy, we always seem to find you just when we need you. My friends, yes, it is an amazing coincidence. How can I help? This is a big one. We have to generate a large downward force, like a piano falling out of a window. I've got just a thing. Is someone literally going to get a piano? Some gifts for you to use whilst artistically airborne. For you, Mr. Yellow Buns, a hopper ball cross with a boxing glove. Now that's how you pack a punch. Next for Miss Intrepid Explorer, a suitcase loaded with perfectly balanced weights. Fabulous. This carry-on will certainly help me carry on. It's funny. I got a donut. For the always hungry one, a giant donut to add sprinkles of success to your mission. Can't find a hole in that logic. A uh, yuck. All right, Donald, what do you get? Great, I'm last again. I'm sh something humiliating, I'm sure. He gets an, an alchemist anvil. <laughs> an anvil? That's stupendous. As long as you don't strain your back carrying it. What? And now, my friends, my tinkering has left me tuckered, but happy smashing. Well, that's interesting. What is it, Minnie? We just got a message from Uncle Steve. I've activated a teleporter shortcut to the top of Forgotten Farmlands, and he's added a marker to our maps. I guess he is good for something. Ground pound. And then I guess we got, yeah, we got fast travel. Accomplishment unlocked. There you go. And you can just, like, break all this stuff now, right? I, I assume you still can't kill enemies with this, right? God, it just feels so odd not being able to do anything with that. Nope. Nothing. In fact, you take damage. Fucking weird. All right, last memorabilia. We got someone in a jar. I fucking broke my switch. We got someone in a jar. Great. Of course. 
Why wouldn't we have uh, just just one more jar for the road? Of course. All right, YouTube. So that's Disney's Illusion Island. Kind of basic. Kind of a cute game, but probably not worth the 40 bones. Uh, that is valid at right now. Could be fun if you got, like I said, like little brothers or sisters or something, but probably wait for a sale. I wish there was more, more combat or something, but I just want to show it off for, oh, almost two hours. Perfect. Um, who the fuck says we need a jar emote? Ban them. Anyway, YouTube, hope you enjoyed. I love you. Take care. Goodbye.